What's good, y'all? It's your boy Saba Sonic Tista. You know what's up, man. My DM podcast weekly episode coming up. You know how we roll, baby. Shout out to everybody showing us love online. The internet is forever. Don't get it twisted. The world's biggest podcast, my DM podcast. Shout out to my team. We got a special guest for you today. We got the boy Diamonds up in the building. Yeah, what's good? What's good, bro? my nigga? Ah, easy. Does, you good? Man. I'm nice, bro. How you how's, doing? How's, how's life, dog? How's everything treating you? Uh, right you the now? new star. You 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 coming up like <laughs> like hella nice, dog. You got it. Your palms and whatnot. Hey, man. <laughs> hey, you know what I'm saying? It's been a long time coming, bro. It's been a long it's time like, coming. Yeah, yeah, it's been a long time coming, yeah. but like shit. It's just it's just so busy right now, bro. Yeah? Yeah, it's, it's just been like But isn't it good to be right busy now. though? I mean it's good, but it's like I feel like like I was telling uh homie earlier on, it's like the transition from me just being in studio mm. all the time and like just you feel me just the recording process basically yes sir making music and jumping from that into like every week is a shoot every second day it's an interview every you feel what I'm saying mm. it's like the transition to that is kind of draining yeah you feel me but I'm enjoying it though yeah I won't lie I am enjoying it it's just mad fun let's talk about that That's transition true. let's talk about that yeah, transition yeah. though um there's a lot of there's a lot of upcoming rappers watching this right yeah and they need to understand like mentally team wise how do you prepare for such a transition because it was just you and your boys in the studio yeah you know doing your thing and now all of a sudden you're with Blackie you're with whatever you know people yeah. hitting you up for interviews yeah. there's the club situation there's managers there's labels potentially yeah. how do you prepare for such a transition I mean I I, I just take shit one step at a time bro. yeah like I just take it one step at a time it's like um, I, I, I I sort of just like kind of plan shit you feel mm -hmm. me? I plan. I don't really plan like fucking ten years in advance or like mm. five years in advance. Mm. I'm like a I'm like a short term short term planner. Mm. But those like your short, short term goals and stuff. What? Like your short term. Yeah, goals yeah. Like my short term goals. You feel me? But like all those short term goals mm. eventually add up to the one big goal that I have. Mm. You feel me? So I, I take things. That's what I mean when I say I take things one step at a time. So for me, it was like because at the time when. When I was doing the project, that was my focus. Mm. You feel me? Mm. Then got that over with. And then mm. immediately after that, it's like, yo, boom. Now you have to do the runs. You have to do the PRing. You have to do the mm. da, da 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 One, two, mm. three, one, two, three. You feel me? So it's like I had to just kind of step back a little bit and like gradually ease into that. You know mm. what I'm saying? So it's like, mm. it's, like it's, it's a bit different, but it's, it's lovely. I ain't going to lie. It's lovely. Yeah. Yeah, you're full time in Jobic now, man. Like, yeah. you you feel like your people in, in Pretoria still understand you? Can you kick it? Is they it for, different, yeah, bro? They forever gonna be oh, yeah? my people, bro. Like, yeah. born and raised out there, man. Yes. I just got to Joburg. Okay, cool. You feel me? Like, okay, I just cool. moved to Joburg like yeah. fully this year. I mean, I was yeah. I was in Midrand before that. Mm -hmm. Um, I, I was in Joburg in, in Rotorua uh, back in 2000 and 2018, 19. I just okay, can't cool. remember which year. Okay, but Rotorua. I was, yeah, I was there for like probably maybe eight to ten months okay I was, cool. I was in there for a while mm, okay but now i moved out here like fully you on this film yeah because i'm trying to i'm trying to actually get my shit on trying yeah. to put my foot in the door you feel me so, yeah. so in other words you saying that if you in pretoria yeah doing this music yeah the move from pretoria to Joburg yeah. is predominantly to just push your craft in yeah for sure excel. yeah for sure it's not it's not it's not it's nothing else but that why is that because i mean pretoria is also you know I feel like a lot of shit that I have to do is in Joburg. Like a lot of shit that I get called up for, a lot of things that they hit me up for studios in Joburg. Okay. okay shows okay. Uh, shows in Joburg. Interview the interview right now is in Joburg. You feel what I'm saying? So it's like, <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm 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 closer to like things that I need to get to and things yeah. that I need to do when I'm around here. So if I was in Pretoria, I'd be like traveling okay, like hold crazy. Okay, let's do this, bro. Let's do this. Damn. So that was that Don't was, even worry about that. Yeah, so that was that was that was a bit of a it was a bit of a drag for me. Yeah. So when the opportunity for me to move to Joburg came, it just made too much sense for me to let that pass. Yeah. Okay. I, I, know, I know also Pretoria is kind of like, it's a bit like laid back, you know, and Joburg is yeah. like, just like everyone's doing something, moving. I mean, Pretoria. Pre are, are out here. I, I mean, uh, like that, that perception of Pretoria right now is, is actually kind of dead because like Pretoria is buzzing right now. Really? Bro, bro it's yeah. been buzzing like, Look at the artists. Yeah, facts look at though. The artists yeah, in the you guys are popping. I was about to say that y'all are popping. Yeah, look at the yeah. artists in the industry, bro. Like yeah. it's mostly Pretoria dudes. You feel what I'm saying? And it's yeah. like that's what I'm saying. Like people with the perception that Pretoria is a bit more slower than Joburg right now. Like right now, and maybe for the past two three years, it hasn't been that way. It's been actually really busy. 
You feel what I'm saying? Like it's been busy. Like although we, I mean, I won't lie, we don't have as much infrastructure and as much. Um, how can I put it? Like as much the industry is as not as mature as this side. I, I don't want to say yeah. industry. That's the thing. I don't. Okay, wanna, cool. I don't want to say industry because I, I don't want to separate it and be like Pretoria is a different industry in Pretoria. I mean, South Africa is one industry. Okay, you feel what I'm saying? But what I'm what I'm trying to say is like Pretoria has its own little thing that's going on and it's not as slow as people think it is. You feel what I'm saying? Like it's busy in its own way. Guys are putting in work in yeah, studio. Yeah, you got the um, fashion, you got yeah. the fashion, you got the fashion people that are doing their thing, you got the events people that are doing their thing, then you have the artists that are doing their thing, down to photographers. You feel what I'm saying? Like it's 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 busy out there, bro. Like it's not it's not as quiet as you think it is. And how are you vibing with Joe Brook now that you're out here? You know, see your book. I mean it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. I I I'm not really an outside person. Like I'm not really outside like that. Like I'm always indoors in the studio with my niggas or like with my family or whatever. So I haven't really like experienced it. You feel what I'm saying? Like I, I mean I know Joburg. I've been in and out, in and around a few places, but I don't really know it like that. So, so I, I I I I can't really say. You feel me? Okay. Like I is. Okay. So let's let's actually let's go let's go into the lifestyle. Yeah. I want to know when you know if I were to spend a day with you, what type of habits? What I have to agree to. <laughs> well, we don't get high, my boy. <laughs> so we, 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 How high do y'all get? Because hey, we, 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 we been with some artists that get really high. Bro, let me tell you something, right? A lot of dudes pull up to the pit studios, my G. Like, a lot of dudes pull up out there. A lot of dudes say they smoke. Yeah. You feel me? And I can literally name drop you the people who are actually... Name drop, keep, my nigga. Don't, don't, keep, don't worry. Name drop. Let's go. Let's go. Like, let's go. Let's go. Like, okay, for example... I mean, Flame and them, they obviously like same structure as us. Yeah, 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 yeah. They, 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 they keep up with the smoke. Pretty ugly also is a heavy smoker. Yeah. Shout out to Pretty Ugly. We had him. We had him a couple of weeks back. Oh shit, that's fine. That's fine. Pretty ugly smokes like heavy. Yeah. Yo, who else, dog? Who else we had out there that, that kept the, kept it up with us? Because a lot of niggas be tapping out. Be tapping out, though. Yeah, niggas be... Who niggas, who, who, who's the first nigga to tap out? <laughs> hey, man. Niggas, 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 gonna, niggas gonna think I'm clowning. Nah, we like, just, we just, we just keep it a hip-hop, though. A lot, a lot of niggas can't smoke with us, bro. Okay. I'm gonna just say it at that. <laughs> I'm gonna just leave it at that. I don't want no bad blood. Niggas be thinking, you know, ah, shit, nigga. I'm gonna, nah, yeah. nah, nah, nah. I'm gonna just keep it at that. A lot of niggas can't smoke yeah. with us. But also, 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 Fox is a smoker. Uh, Zinger in them. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, them niggas smoke bro. them niggas uh, yeah, and, 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 and what, what, what is, what, how does how does it how does it help with the creativity to do songs and, and really do this this thing that you guys are doing man? I mean for me right I'm I'm speaking for myself yeah. bro. like for me it's like I don't even know how to explain it bro it's like when I hear the beat off the weed like mm. it, whenever Liz plays the beat or, come Zeus, on now. or Zeus playing the beat like I'm I'm chilling with the tray you feel me uh, come I'm, on I got now. the tray here rolling it up I'm trying yeah. to get into that element because like oh, yeah. it's sort of like channeling in a way okay. you know what I'm saying Word. so when I, when I smoke the when I smoke the herb and I go in the stool it's like I, I hear it differently okay Sativa Indica, what type of, what's your flavor? I ain't picky, bro. Okay, whatever, yeah, whatever, whatever knocks yeah, hard. Whatever, I need, I need that cake, you feel me? I need the cake. If that shit got the cake, we could go. Yeah. yeah. And we can see it, because, I mean, shout out to, shout out to, you got a nice video, man. It's your palms. Yeah, shout I out, love man. that shit. Shout out, shout out my dog, Vaughn. Like, yeah, he, 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 shout out to Vaughn. He came with the idea. He hit me, actually. He's like, yo, yeah. man, because initially, I wanted to shoot for Contraband. Oh, okay, cool. You feel me? That, okay, was, cool. that was the video I actually wanted to yeah. shoot for, and I remember we were sitting down there, like, planning it, yeah. like, ah, shit, like, uh, and then we all agreed Hey yeah. We're gonna shoot Contraband And I was yeah. like Alright for sure I think maybe like A week later A week later He hit me He's like My boy Check this out We have to shoot Itchy Palms I'm like Wow what's up What's the He's yeah. like Yo I got this Fire idea bro Like yeah. that's the idea That's actually playing around In my oh, head yeah, right yeah, now yeah. And if we have to execute it So I'm like Alright I'm gonna pull up And you're gonna tell me More about it Pulled up Exactly how you see the video Came out smooth is exactly how we said it Damn. No cap, no Damn. cap. And so, he, 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 him, and 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 the team, they they shot it like it's okay. Them, it's them on the visuals too. So man, I was too like, nice. So when out, when you when you're on YouTube, him. when you're on YouTube and you and you're watching your video, you're watching you know other peers in the game. What exactly are you looking for, man? Like when I'm watching my yeah, videos, your videos and just the game in general. What exactly are you looking at? What what blind spots are you looking out for? I mean, I'm just looking at how to better what they doing. Okay. You feel me? Like that's what that's why I, I look I watch videos. I yeah. mean, it's, it's it's more of like a research purpose, you feel me? Yeah. And then I just bump into shit I like from there. Yeah. But it's like uh, I look at like, you know, okay, 
that's a fire idea. But if you could have, ah, sh- you feel me? Like, okay. switch that, put that over yeah. here. Usually, that's what I do. Like, yeah, okay. I, I, I watch for like ways to improve that and make, mm. and make it like a better. You feel me? Yeah. Mm. Also, like, also like fusing ideas and fusing, like fusing shit. Bro. Okay, like, just concepts fu- and whatnot. Yeah, concepts yeah. and even just like direction and like mm. all that shit. You feel me? Like, I yeah, references yeah. and all that shit. You feel yeah. me? Like, that's. That's that's usually what I watch the yeah. videos for. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Shout out to the producer behind the scenes. That's <laughs> let's talk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So look, man, I just want to know. Name drop a video that when you were looking at it, another artist video, you're like, uh, we could have done a little bit better, or I could have done it like this. Damn, man, you are gonna make me. Come on, can I, my nigga, it's gonna, it's all love. Niggas understand it's all you love, gonna, bro. You gonna, you feel me? You gonna cause some controversy? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all just love, bro. <laughs> you know. Um, shit. Let me think. Because I, I see that direct eye in you. Yeah, yeah. You know, from 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 the music video you shot with Blackie, you know, at the graveside, bro. That's that's yeah. that's sick. I'm 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 gonna be honest with you, bro. Like yeah. I, I don't have the director eye, bro. Like I'm I'm fully in the music side. So what I usually do is I get the songs, right? And I just I send them to the music video mm. I'm like, yo, I got the new song. And mm. but when I'm dead, I had sent the song to Morale and he literally called me back. He's like, yo, I got an idea for this. Mm. I'm like, yo, what's your idea? So mm. I'm more of like a approve or disapprove type guy. Like, all right, I like that idea. We can go with that. Or all right, nah, I don't like that idea. Maybe like I'll get me and my guys to sit and think how we can make it better or whatever. Mm. But like, I'm not really the guy that comes up with the ideas. Oh. So I don't want to take credit for that. I want to yeah. credit the right guys for that. Yeah. So like, yeah, Morale, he, he genuinely came up with the idea. I remember that day we were shooting, we were shooting the video. It was actually a pretty shit day. Cause uh, this like, is this not itchy palms. No, no, no. This was uh, when I'm well, itchy palms was the most fire day. But like yeah. when I'm dead, it was a bit crazy. Okay, cool. Like getting that video together because yeah. there was a lot of waiting. There was a lot of ups and downs. You feel me? It was mm. like it almost felt like it was short planned and it really wasn't. You feel what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So it was like it took a lot to get it together. And then after that. I had to wait for like I think about a month or two to, just to get the final cut. Damn! After I got doesn't the irritate final, Doc, bro. I was, I was <laughs> what, what, what was that? What, what was the delay? Uh, I, fuck! I don't even fucking know, bro. Like I kept on, <laughs> I kept on hitting up Morale and he was yeah. fucking drunk all the time. Like, nigga. Morale, come on, stop playing with my boy. Like, nigga, Shout out to Morale, nah, bro. He, nah, see. he my boy. Like and, he then you, boy like and he that. shoots nice videos, dog. That's the bro, thing. Like in my opinion, the best we got out here. Yeah. In my opinion, yeah. you feel me? like he's genuinely the best because mm. I always tell everybody I meet or everybody I bump in, everybody that asks me about him, mm. I always tell them the same shit like, yo, bro, that nigga, like, his eyes crazy. I mean, he shot when I'm dead drunk. Mm. Are you right for real? I'm telling you, bro, like, he was drunk. Like, literally. Shout out to Morale. He's the shit. Morale, I'm gonna come with a bottle of some, some. I see you, dog. Yeah, just get, <laughs> put him on a young Henny. Ah, you nice, boy. You gonna get the most fire video in the game. Yeah. But, like, yeah, Shut bro, up. like, we, we, I had a, I had a little back and forth with him, but, like, he explained to me, he's like, yo, listen, uh, the video is done right now, da, 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 but I feel like we gotta shoot some more scenes, blah, 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 and we did that. So, when the final, when the final product came, I was happy with it. I won't lie. I was like, yo, it's a fire video, man. Let's fucking roll it. Let's drop it. And then, yeah. But it was a shit. I remember the day we were shooting it. It was pretty shit, bro. Yeah. Yeah, it was, a, it was an assy day. So night comes to you. They're like, yo, boy, we want you to go that cheese scope for this ad campaign. Say what? <laughs> Would you ever go cheese scope? Yo, I love Nike, but yo, my hair, my G. <laughs> but how much about? would it cost though? Come on, it's, it's, it's a number. It's nah, number nah, a number. Nah, my nigga, ain't no price. Nah, number. nah, come on. I'm Diamonds. Come on, man. Yo. If bro. Nike were to cut that check and say, nigga, here's, here's out, a right? Jordan co-sign right here. Check this out, right? If y'all got that much money, y'all got as much money for a ma- little makeup artist. <laughs> Come you know what I'm saying hide the shit nigga put the shit in the what we got females that are bold on movies but they ain't bold in real life oh, so you, only you feel what that. I'm saying yeah nigga why you, why you want me to cut my hair you feel me this shit this shit right here is spiritual my dude. <laughs> oh wait how long how long you had it uh, when did I start this shit I think I started it in 2017 okay go cool. yeah I think 2017 like early 2017 okay, late 2016 cool. early 2017 yeah already. so 2017 that's when obviously you that um Suki called the EP. Which one's that one, blood? Um oh, yeah, 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 I was I was on the feature. Okay. Yeah, I and was then, on the feature. And then if you go to like 2019 where you actually joined the EP. joint project, yeah for yeah. sure. Yeah. How was how was that for you? What that was Zuki fire, bro. Like it's Zuchi actually, yeah. not Zuki. It's Zuchi. Oh. Yeah, but like that was that was fire, bro. I mean me and Zu been brothers since like pff, primary school, bro. Before really? Like, yeah. Y'all are like, tight. Yeah, bro, that's my brother. Like that's my blood. Like, okay, cool. You feel me? Like, yeah, that's my that's my dog for real. Like, I, I, we made 
I think I was 12 when I met homie. Okay, so, cool. Yeah, I was probably like 12 when we just we did this shit and still doing it till now. Uh. So for me, it was more of a thing like when, when, because it was his idea to do the joint project. It wasn't my idea. You feel me? So he pulled up to me. He's like, yo, the shit you're doing is fire. Like, you feel me? Like, I feel like what we need to do for you right now is this joint project. You feel what I'm saying? So he just hit me and he's like, yo, Check this out. Let's do this joint project. You feel me? Die dope. You know, drop this shit on. I'm like, oh, that's fire, bro. Like, I mean, at the stage you had in your career and the stage I'm at in my career. You feel respect, me? Yeah. yeah, it was like, it, it, it did it literally out of love. And like, I think both of us, we were doing it like for fun. You feel me? And it was, How like, long did it take you to make it? Oh, uh, bro, I think <laughs> probably like a month. And a month of like in between us too, like in mm. between taking like a break, yeah, you, know, you know, stone, whatever, get high, play some PlayStation. Yeah. And then probably like the next day we're like, all right, bro, let's go back to the studio. Let's go kick it. And then we get in there, we do the song, do the song, all right, hiatus, take a break, chill out. That's a solid project, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Shout out, yeah. man. Shout yeah. out. But but yeah, like as I was, I was about to say, like we didn't expect, well, I, let me speak for myself. I didn't expect for it to do so well. I mean, it's still my biggest project by far. Mm. Like right now, like mm. Die Dope is still my biggest project. Even mm. more than, like whatever I have out, mm. Die Dope is the biggest project I have out. Like I didn't expect people to receive it the way they mm. did, you feel what I'm saying? So that for me, it meant a lot more, you feel me? Because I was like, shit, like, Zoo's really, you feel me? Like he really came down and he's yeah. like, yo, my G, like we're gonna do this for you. And we actually did it. Yeah. Yeah. So for me, it was, it was, it was a, it was more like a blessing. It was, yeah. it was fire for me. Yeah. Like, yeah, I enjoyed that. Let's have money chats. How much? How much? How much money? How much money in your in your in your wallet do you, you start stressing? Uh, uh, I'm starting to get a little bit dry here. <laughs> <laughs> when I think I'm broke. <laughs> yeah. Um, let me see. Probably like five four k. That's when you can be like, I right. damn nigga, you got money. I mean, what's five k, bro? You could you could kick that in one, like not even an outing. Like you could just go to one shop and fuck up five k. Okay, cool. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah, like, you, could, you could spend five k on a shoe, bro. Oh okay. way. So it's like when you when you have five k, it's like you, right, you start you, you start you, you start stressing money. a bit. Yeah, yeah, you got some money, but it's like, I mean, I was having the conversation with with, with bro just now, now, like yeah, there's real money out there, bro. Facts. Like there's. Heavy real bags. money like there's heavy bags there's yeah, real facts, wop, facts, facts, so facts. I mean at my level I feel like a 5k is like I right, my niggas start stressing out yeah you know, like hold yeah. on like keep it together yeah. you feel me? panic like, mode is like hey man it's coming yeah, it's becoming getting, a little dry exactly you know what I mean I'm playing for the next bag or yeah. take the distro yeah. what, what the distro yeah. looking like you know what I'm saying yeah. Yeah. so yeah. I'd, I'd say like 4 or 5k okay yeah. okay so, you just moved to Joburg what area of Joburg would you never rent to stay what I never yeah, oh, which Hill area? Of- Hill <laughs> 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 Fuck you, bro. Hey, man, Uncle Vinny gonna have a problem with you. What? Uncle Vinny from Hill, bro. Oh, he used to stay there back I, in the day. You gonna have a problem because I don't like the place? <laughs> <laughs> That's like me. Hey, but a- I don't wanna lie, dog. Your bro's rough, though. <laughs> bro, like, bro, like, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, it's like, it's like, the I'm, 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 shit, you and Hill, bro. Let me give you a scenario, yeah. right? You and Hill, bro, right? Who's the flyest mama you know in South Africa or the flyest mama you trying to get? Uh, yeah it's cool you don't have to name drop it's her right it's, like her. it's cool nah, you don't even got a name drop her right she hit you up she like yo slime I'm finna pull up on you yeah. for like a weekend you know yeah. what I'm saying I'm finna yeah. put it on you and then you drop the location and it says hell bro I'm like yo bro and this the baddest mommy you know yeah you feel me it's, it's a bit different bro yeah. it's like shit I mean it's cool when you're from there and I'm, and you're just like you know let me take her to the trap you feel me? Let me, yeah. you, let me show her the trap. Yeah. But don't fucking spend the night there, my G. Like, don't. You feel oh, what I'm saying? There's, oh, there's places out oh, here. Oh, oh, that's just oh, how I feel. Like, that's, oh, oh, that's just how I but feel. But shout out to Hillbrook got strip clubs, man. Fuck you know? strip clubs. What is your problem with strip clubs, dog? I don't got a problem. Fuck the strip clubs in Hillbrook. Oh. <laughs> so what strip clubs you go to? Club. I went to XO. We shot. We actually, me and Flame shot a... Uh, Red Outro. We oh, shot, we shot Red Outro at the strip club in EXO. Oh, yeah, the only red red. Me. I mean, oh, yeah? bro, like there's five strip clubs, bro. Like, oh yeah, walking there, you find some Asian tan. Yeah, you know oh yeah, so, like it's five strip clubs. Yeah, bro. that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Like, hey yeah. man, like, yeah. I mean, I I don't know, bro. I guess I'm just a person of like a certain standard. You know, I'm not bashing yeah. it or nothing. I understand that some people are out there not by choice, but it's just a thing of like, yeah, I have preferences. Okay, especially. cool. You feel me? Okay, <laughs> My cool. preference is not that. Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But like, yo, hell, bro, for sure, I'd never go there. Yeah. Besides your phone and wallet, what, what, what do you walk around else? What do you walk around with? Man? My weed. Ah, shout out. 
<laughs> You're a real rapper. I always, I always gotta have a weed and a lighter, bro. But you know what? We we had we had chats with with ugly, um, pretty ugly, like last week, and yeah, the chat was, aside from music, yeah. where else are you getting your money from? You know, I mean, just music, bro. Just music. Yeah, I'm and literally eating off a demo. <laughs> no cap. Yeah, I mean it's holding me down. Yeah, you feel what I'm saying? I mean, throughout the whole lockdown, bro, I was surviving off music. I'm not, I'm not like, I'm was it not online like, game? Was it online online side of things? Because I mean, there weren't any performances. Yeah, yeah, online. Okay. I mean, obviously, like yeah, my my fucking distribution and okay, like cool. you feel me uh, features on the side. You yeah, know what I'm saying? like shit yeah, like that. Yeah. That's how I was surviving through through a uh, lockdown, bro. Like just entirely music. I mean, this is my plan A. That is, that is dope. That I don't dope. have a plan B. So for me, it's like, yo, this I gotta make this shit work. You, feel you me know like? what? To have, to have such like guts and, and, and move like that is just commendable for me. Yeah, know? bro. And um, just on that note of business, would there be anything else that you do aside oh, from hell music? Oh yeah. hell yeah, yeah. I mean, I mean, I mean, as you grow up as a person, mm. you get to realize that hey, as I was saying, there's real money. There's outside. real money outside, and yeah. even the richest rapper in the game in the world oh, yeah. is not like close to yeah. what the richest people, people in are. the world are yeah. you what I'm saying so it's like cause there's some money in Tycoon man there's some dudes with real money bro you feel me bro like yeah. Jay-Z just touched a billion in 2019 yeah 2017 yeah. somewhere there 2017 yeah. 2017 yeah. 2017 yeah. he just touched the billion Easy just touched the billion last year and Damn. he's the richest rapper we got right now oh, yeah. like, you feel me that's kind of yeah. he just touched it last year and mm. not even through music alone mm. he's got the fashion shit going Facts. on you feel what I'm saying so Facts. if it was the music alone it wouldn't Rihanna just touched the billion off the makeup for you, what, what would be that one thing that you can think of the top of your head? You know, I think I'll do. I'll get into this industry. Property, bro. property, easily, like easily, like property. Like Residential, if, commercial, if, commercial for sure. Okay, commercial for sure. But I mean, I if I had if I had the money for it, I would dabble in there. I dabble in residential and like, mm. but like like. <sighs> Middle class, middle class, middle class, upper, upper, upper class, middle class, upper class, upper away, class away, 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 residential away. properties. That's what I would get into. But like commercial for sure, because that's a guaranteed bag. And long term, fucking month. And long term, bro. And long term, too, you can sign you know ten year contracts with like pick and pay, for example. Exactly. Niggas just fuck out the money and it's not yeah. Exactly. Facts. So I'd I'd go into that. I'd go into commercial for sure. Like rent out fucking buildings for businesses. You mm. feel me? Like yo. This business is gonna come and operate here. They're gonna pay me rent. Da 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 da. You feel me? Like that type of shit. Or like land. Get them motherfuckers to build their shit there and pay me for their shit. You feel what I'm saying? Like shit like that, bro. Like that's what I would invest in. Like land. Okay. okay. Let's talk about these girls, man. Name drop a TV soap actress. You you were you that definitely could get it. TV soap actress. I don't know. I don't be watching TV. Okay, like any that, any girl Instagram, Instagram, because like, like, we know niggas on Instagram. Let's take it to the <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I got who you, 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 who you like trying to say? Yeah. Damn. Just name five. Damn, our Kim J Top is five. bad boy. Okay, shout Kim out Kim J. Kim J. Bad. Shout out Kim J. You bad as fuck, man. Uh, That's one. Uh, how many should I name? Five. Drop? Five. It's top five, bro. Um shit, man. I don't even I don't even be knowing this popular bitches like that. I mean mommies, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't I don't really We mean that with love. Like that. We yeah, mean that with women love. Women that we love, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you, you know they're not they bad bitch. Yeah, 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 so, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, Second one. Shit, I'm trying to think, man. Like, I, I don't really be knowing them like that. I just know Kim J because she bad as fuck. She been in your head all day like that. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. I, I got money in my head all day like that. Hey, yo, Kim. Like, we just waiting for that head. summer nomination. <laughs> we running up on you. <laughs> uh, hold on, hold on. Let me think, let me think, let me think. I definitely got a few, bro. I'm just trying to get my name on it. I mean, their names on there. Um, shit. Why your name on there? Who the, 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 um, who the mommy from Blood and Water? The, 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 the rich bitch. Uh, rich mom, goddamn. Can I get mine? And I saw the trailer. That yeah, one. that one, that one, that she one. That bad one. too. I think yeah. she bad too. Yeah. Um, Instagram models. I don't. I don't really be liking Instagram models because of the, you know. I yeah. like. I like low key mommies. Low key. What's low key? What's a low key mommy for you? Like a mommy that's just be doing her. Like okay. Just, just do you. Like you know. I know she. She not living for social. You know, mommies these days they be living for social media. Bro. Mm. And I like. I'm not. I'm not really for that. No, you yeah. Know what I'm saying like it's not it's not really for me. I oh, like yeah. I like more reserved. Okay. Reserved females, females okay. that like 
you know be doing them on the side you yeah know? a young 5k followers yeah. Diana, you can you see know. that she's not really about she's not really it about she's that. just there to, yeah. you know, to show you that you're I got it. Yeah, to show you that I got <laughs> it but like it's not really my thing you feel yeah. me I go to work Monday to Friday you know what I'm yeah. saying like I be doing my th- I, yeah. I got my business I got yeah, yeah those are the yeah. mommies I fuck yeah. with though because oh her name is Kosi and she actually is in Joburg and you're here now. Bad, but she me location, Kosi. Kosi, we see you, girl. Blood and water. Pull we pop in. I'm on the show, too. <laughs> show too. My song was playing on the show. Is it? Is it? Oh, yeah, for sure. Shout out! Uh, uh, fine young man. Oh, dope. Fine young man. Fine young man with, 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 with flame. Congratulations the, on that. Shout out. Shout, shout out, out to out. Netflix you for putting my boy back now. Huh? Another bag. Hey man, I told you the money stays on my mind. The money stays on my yeah. mind. Yeah, you know yeah. Saying? But yeah, um, in terms of like girls and all, like I really prefer like laid back mommies. That's that's my vibe. Like, okay, hey, cool. I'm, I'm a sucker for those. Like, uh, yeah, you know what I'm saying, yeah, yeah. What's your religion, raw or condom? Ha! Condom, bro. <laughs> I'm in the streets. Hey, yeah, the streets are. I'm in the streets. Yeah, like, the streets I'm not. Are, yeah, like, yeah, I'm not. the streets are hard. Hey, my G, I'm not. I'm not in a. I'm not in a relationship or nothing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But at the same time, it's like, you know, a nigga is still a nigga at the mm, end of the day. Mm. So I can't be moving like that. Mm. You feel me? Like mm. I'm. I'm. Yo, bro. I got. I got a lot of shit. I got a lot of shit I still gotta do yeah. in my life, and I can't afford that to come and hinder everything I want to achieve. Yeah, you feel what I'm saying? So it's like there's bigger things than that. Like yo, psh, nah, bro. Yeah, definitely strapping. Yeah, up. yeah. <laughs> you feel yeah. Me? What's yeah. the craziest mommy like mommy engagement you guys have ever had? Like with your peers? Yo, let me tell you this one, right? Yeah, yeah. Shit. One time we in vendor, right? Okay, vendor. Yeah, we Limbo in hard. Yeah, we in vendor like. Inside, inside, yeah, vendor, like greenery and shit. Yeah, you feel yeah. me? So it's me and Zoo and our homeboy Huey, and it's literally just the three of us. Take a fucking H1, drive out there, motherfucker. We had a show out there, right? Oh, right. Yeah. We go out there, get there, cool, do the perform in the rain. We performed in the rain for a whole st- like little stadium setup. You feel me? Motherfucker was singing a song in the rain. That shit was fire. But anyway, check this out. Show ends because it got it rained too much and the shit started raining on the motherfucking CDJs and shit. So show had to get cut. Da 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 da. da you feel me? All right, cool. Escort us to the motherfucking uh, H1. Mm. Get in the truck. Once we get in the truck, we gotta. It's like it's blocked. You feel me? Like the 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 way out is the blocked. The way out is blocked. Yeah. So we had to call the motherfucking like Jay smashing them. Like we had to call them in because they were the ones hosting the event. Okay, cool. We had to call them like, yo, man, we trying to dip this motherfucker. Shit is stuck. Like we stuck. Like we can't even we can't exit. Go, yeah. Mind you, it's raining. It's raining. It's muddy. Shit. Right. Keep those two. Nowhere. Keep those two factors in mind. All right. Cool. Eventually, the motherfucking cars clear up. Trying to make our way out. As we making our way out, car gets stuck. Right in, in the, the mud. mud. You feel me? You feel me? We trying Nowhere. to get the shit out the out niggas the mud. are in the back. You feel me? You know nah, what I mean? nobody at the back. Yet. Okay. Now the cars are. Like everybody's in the car. Cause like, it's raining, it's pouring, yeah, 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 it's, it's pouring. like oh, hey. it's pouring. We're trying to dip. You feel me? So hey, we stuck out here, bro. There was a girl right outside, right? I was. I remember I was sitting on this side. There was a girl right outside here with a dude, and this girl, she's in fucking denim shorts, motherfucking. I don't know what they call them, motherfucking crop top. Uh, crop top. You feel me? Oh, yeah. In the motherfucking crop top, in the rain, in the mud, right? And she's saying, "Yo, open this door." I got to talk to y'all. If I don't talk to y'all, this car won't leave. Shit. You feel me? Mind you, my G, we all the way in Vendor, dog. You feel me? We inside. I don't know. Nobody out there, my G, it's about, I don't know. I think it was like 1 a.m. Oh, yeah. 1 a.m. in the morning, bro. Like, it's so you guys are looking crazy. at each other like, okay, so, what, what the fuck now? So niggas ain't noticed that, right? So I go, yo. There's a girl outside, guys. Are you hearing what this mommy's saying? <laughs> She's hitting me with the blue tip. Yeah, I'm like, are you hearing what this mommy's <laughs> saying? Right? Like, oh, my mama, bro. Like, I'm Huge. like, yo, are you hearing what this mommy saying? She say we, we need to open the door. We stuck because of her. She saying the car won't leave if we don't open the door. She on some voodoo shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so I start tripping. I start tripping. I'm like, yo, this is crazy. Where, where you hot? Stone, I'm old. I'm high right now. <laughs> I'm high right now. So I'm like, yo, yeah. Niggas, this is a bit weird for me. That you know open magic, you feel me? <laughs> so I'm like, shit, okay. Yo, this is tricky for me. So what happened? 
So we called Jay Smash again. We're like, yo, <laughs> we stuck, bro. We like, stuck, bro. Hit up somebody to come pull us out. Yeah. Shit. All right, some nigga pulled up. He's like, nah, uh, it's not that deep in. Uh, I can get it out for y'all. Yeah. We don't got to pull it. All right, yeah. got it. So now when he gets in, the mommy's still there. He's like, yo, tell them niggas to open this door. <laughs> You're right? wasting your time, bro. I'm like, no, niggas, we are not opening. So he was like a, he's like a, he's like a fool. He's like a straight fool. He's like, yo, I'm finna open this door, bro. I'm finna hear what she said about my nigga. If you open this door, I'm gonna kick you out and then I'm gonna close it. And then you gonna stay out there oh, with her and like finish it off oh, whatever yeah, conversation yeah, yeah. y'all trying to have because I ain't trying to hear none of that. My Juwashi in the rain in the shorts telling us we ain't gonna move unless we speak to her. Yeah. I want... Guess what? When we get to the booked accommodation, right? The bitch is there uh, with some other dudes. I'm like, nah, I'm not cheap. This is crazy. I literally we went in, bro, on my mama. Like, we literally went inside. I, I went inside the room and I was like, yo, I'm gonna smoke this joint in here, smoke and pass out. <laughs> I don't so want no dry problems, for the you shit. Feel me? Load shedding had hit at the time. Yeah. Like, it was just the situation was just dire, bro. It was yeah. just crazy. It was just yeah. like, I don't deserve this shit right now. If you might yeah. come from a show. I deserve to be in some fine thighs, mm. fire joint. Yeah. Just call it a day. You feel yeah. what I'm saying? That's all I wanted. But yeah. I was bumping into crazy voodoo bitches. And yeah. that just wasn't for me. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to the boy. Mm. You feel what I'm saying? So it's never a thing of like, I'm going to keep... Because you know when you keep shit in, that's what causes problems. Like when mm. you build, when you keep shit in, that shit starts building up. Yeah. When you don't express what made you uncomfortable when you don't express what you don't like in that certain situation and you keep that in. Yeah. That's going to cause you to start building it up and now when something pops off eventually after a certain amount of you know fuck ups or build ups that you've been bottling in yeah. you're just gonna explode and that's what causes problems yeah. you feel what I'm saying so mm. with us it's like we all we all kind of like on the same wavelength we all understand each other so it's like for example if me and Liz like we, I mean we argue all the time like mm. don't get me twisted we argue like all the time like we have debates and arguments but it's like even even with that happening, we always there's always a an understanding of yo, that's still my bro. Like you feel what I'm saying? Okay, like, cool. Like it's never a thing of yo, fuck you now. Like offer offer some small little. You feel what I'm saying? And yeah. also we also treat each other with respect. So there's never be something. There'll never be something that they would do or I would do that's like kind of stepping on their toes or okay. they're stepping on my toes type shit. You feel what I'm saying? One thousand. There's respect in there, and there's also maturity to understand that we can talk about things mm. without it affecting the relationship we have. Okay. You feel what I'm saying? So that's why I'm saying like with us, there's really problems. But even if there is, we do have the maturity to sit down and talk about it and resolve it. Yeah. In like a, a positive way. Yeah. Yeah. Let's keep it 1000, bro. This is hip hop, right? <clears throat> For sure. Three rappers. Yeah. That you need to dethrone to get to the top. Three rappers that I need to dethrone. Dethrone to get to the top. In my opinion. Yeah. All right. Casper. Uh, One. Um, who's out there with him, man? Um, I used to I used to fuck with AKA, but like, I don't know. He hasn't been giving me the hits right now. You know, he hasn't been he hasn't been doing what I originally mm. fucked with him for. Mm. And why 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 do you think that is, man? I really a lot of people know, have been man. saying that they're like, hey, bruh I you really know, know uh, we 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 see you, but something different. Yeah, like <clears> I I really don't know, man. It it actually actually even kind of saddens me bro because it's like that's really one of the dudes i used to sit at home watch on tv and be like i want to be that nigga or like yeah. i want to work with that nigga at some point yeah like, was, he was literally like my favorite south african rapper yeah you feel what i'm saying but yeah man i guess you know it is what it is happen. yeah it is yeah. what it is bro i mean everybody everybody has their time bro like, you think it's, it's the thing place. that happened with his mommy Nah, oh, that was even I, before I, that. I started feeling that even way before that. Seriously, dog? Yeah, like way before that, bro. So the, what do you think about that Bova Mania rig? The record, Bova Mania. Nah, bro, it's not for me. Okay, I feel you. Yeah, it's not for me, bro. Like the last time I fucked with AKA was probably like on All Lies on Me. Like, that Shit, is, like, that's, that that's, that's, a, that's, a, that's a minute ago. Yeah, that era. That's the last AKA project that I probably had on my phone listening to Facts. or like actually vibing to. Facts. Like, but like everything after that went for me. Okay. And then number three, let me see. Uh, the niggas I'm trying to dethrone are not at the top, so it's not really dethroning. It's just niggas I don't really enjoy. So who that's so like? It's Give me them whack rappers. Who whack? Hey man, <laughs> <laughs> it's hip hop, bro. And not not everybody can be can be. Yeah, you can, can be, be a gorilla. Cup of tea, you know what I'm saying? I yeah. Mean, I mean, there's some dudes out there that also think I'm whack, and that's perfectly fine. Like, I ain't mad at that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's cool. Like, yeah. I might just not be 
for you. For you, yeah. You feel me? So that's yeah. cool. But I think, I th- like, rappers that are really not for me, like, in this era, um, like, Costa's not for me. I'm, like, I'm, I mean, I've never met bruh, you know? Okay. And I don't have a problem with bruh. Never, just, yeah. like, it's just, I'm answering your question yeah. right now. So yeah. even him, he mustn't take this personally. Like, yeah, yeah. You know, I'm, just, I'm answering you. My nigga, this is hip hop. Don't even worry about it. Yeah. We, no, we, I, we I, gonna I, get I, him here. I ain't worried. You, you, you gonna understand. You gonna watch this. You gonna understand. <laughs> I it's hip hop. Check this out. I'm not worried. I'm just ironing it out. Yeah. So even, even yeah. for example, if it reaches him or whatever, yeah. like he understands where I'm coming from. Yeah, I'm sir. not bashing him. Yes, sir. I'm just telling him my honest opinion. Opinion, yeah. You feel me? Like it's definitely not for me, that one. And uh, who else? Let me see, man. I don't really be listening to like a lot of. I listen to the shit I fuck with. That's the, that's my problem. Mm. You feel me? I listen to what I fuck with. I don't just be listening to listen. You feel yeah. Me? Like yeah. Uh, let me see who else, man. Let me think. Hmm. Damn, man. Why are the names running away when I'm trying to think about it? I don't. I don't really know, man. Like yeah. But yeah, like that's. Yeah, I but I appreciate the honesty. I appreciate the honesty. Look, yeah, I think just been I think AKA has been through a lot, and I think he's getting to a point where it 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 he's been in the game for a long time. Yeah, and reinventing yourself is a difficult job, and I think he's it's a new generation right now. Yeah, it's a whole. Yeah. I mean, you guys are coming up. Blackie, Lucas Raps. Real raps are coming Real up. Real raps are coming up. You know what I mean? And Shout and 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 y- y'all are y'all are coming with that. Y'all got y'all niggas, y'all yo, y'all niggas are not playing games. But I mean, but I mean, bro, like I I I think it's also like a like a like a I don't wanna say personality thing, but I guess that's what it is. It's, I think it's like a personality thing where you know you 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 because I mean even for me there's like a lot of growth. That I had to go through to get where I am. Yes, you know sir. What I'm saying? And and in growth, there's a lot of listening. Yes, sir. You feel me? So you have to like be able to listen and take in the advice and like the opinions of that 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 the people you have around you, mm. right? Because you always gotta you always gotta have people that are brutally honest around you. Yes, sir. You feel what I'm saying? And and if you don't have that and you start doing things just off of off of your own, you know what I'm saying? If you, yes, and, sir. And, and especially if you're not your biggest critique at that yes sir you feel what i'm saying if you don't criticize your music the most at that then you're gonna i mean it's gonna show bro yes sir you feel what i'm saying so i i feel like a lot of that a lot of that is, is happening and a lot of that needs to be stopped a lot of people start needing to be honest with themselves and their music facts and people just start need to being sure of their shit you feel mm. what i'm saying facts facts yeah. facts and bring me into that world right because you in that world legit right like you literally in that world when you're around your peers blackie you know, uh, 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 when you're around, you know, 25K, when you're around Zushi, what y'all talk about regarding the game? Like, what are y'all, what are y'all saying amongst each other about the game and where the game is going? I mean, I mean, uh, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not really like that close with Blackie. Okay, cool. All right. Like, I mean, I'm cool. I'm cool with the dude. You know, he's, he's dope ass nigga. Yeah. I fuck with him a long way, but I wouldn't really say like, we bros like that because we haven't really spent the day or okay, like, cool. Like, like we just link up via work and all okay, that okay cool but yeah but he's, he's he's a cool nigga like he's a cool nigga i like to spend a day with him and like just check him out and like shout out know, vibe shout out and all that but like when i'm sitting with my niggas like like kilo's my nigga you know mm. sushi's my nigga liz mm. is my nigga 25k yeah 20 that's f- what the your, your pretoria niggas are hard man yeah for sure 20, yeah 25 is my dog bro. yeah like, Man, by the way, it's, talk to that nigga. We've been trying to highlight that nigga to get to the show, but anyway, that's another conversation. Yeah, <laughs> but yeah, like when we when we sit and have conversation, bro, we talk about how we gonna fuck up the game, bro. Like okay. we just we just looking at it like, oh, like oh, you niggas, oh, you focused more on that. Oh, you niggas ain't looking at the music. All right, we gonna look at the music, and that's mm. how we gonna fuck y'all up. You feel mm. me? Because y'all niggas too focused on the shit that don't matter. Mm. You feel me? You focus mm. on the wrong things. We gonna focus on the music, and that's what that's all you need. Like, okay, the music will speak for you. you okay, feel what I'm saying like the music will speak for itself, my bro. So I know you tied with. Talk I know you tied with Flame. Yeah, that my bro. Um, what's your relationship with Aries? What do you feel about Aries? I don't know, bro. You've never met him before? I met him. Well, well, met well, him. How, how was it? Well, how, what was the chemistry? Well, well, well. It was just the, yo, what's up? What's up? All right, all right. Yeah. That's that. But this was like back in 20, when they were still teed up. Okay, cool. Yeah. Yeah. So I don't really know, bro. Like, I don't. Would you I like to work with I him? I mean, yeah, for sure. He's fine. Yeah. He's fine. I get tags on Twitter almost every day, bro. Like, yeah. 
Diamonds in a re-switch. Diamonds in a re-switch. You oh, know what yeah. I'm saying? So it's like, I'd like for that to happen. That's yeah. fire, bro. Like, yeah. I think he's yo, yeah. one of South Africa's greatest. Oh, yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Nah, he the one, bro. He's fire, bro. Like, I fuck with Reese yeah. the long way, but like, I haven't, like I said, like, I haven't, I don't know, I don't really know, bro. So I can't, yeah. I can't really answer your question. Okay. But if you were, if you were to work with him, it wouldn't mess up your situation with Flame or none of that. It wouldn't make sense if it did. Nah. It wouldn't make sense if it did. Like, I'm too real, bro. Like, that's what I'm saying. Like, yeah. I, I, I literally, like, everything that I do, like, I, I address it directly. Oh, like, yeah. yo, bro, like, if I'm finna go work with Reese, like, I'm gonna go work with Reese. Like, that's why, what it is. That's, I'm working for my career. Bro. Yeah. Like, you feel me? like, this is I my, love that. This is my, this is my journey. Like, yeah. It's not a beef I inherit. I don't have beef with Reese. Okay, I don't cool. know him. I can't, how do I beef with a nigga? I don't know. Mm. You feel what I'm saying? Like, that's maturity, bro. Yeah, I don't, I, I I don't have a problem with bro. I think he's yeah. fine. I bump that nigga yeah. music on probably like every yeah. day, like on a daily. Yeah. But yeah, bro, like that's that's just how I see it. Like if I had to go work with Reese, I wouldn't understand if like, for example, if Flame would have a problem mm. with it. Bro. I'd be mm. like, yo, what are you on about? Yeah. yeah. And when y'all kicking it, has 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 an Aries <laughs> conversation ever came up or is just something like like mu- on on, to- on, 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 on like music you, side, yeah. Okay. Music side, yeah. With 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 flame, I'm talking yeah, about. Yeah, for sure. Okay. And, and, and what's what's the, like like as I'm saying, like what's bro, the vibes like, with with him? When you're discussing like in Reese or just in general, like yeah. you know, Reese dropped, you know, just now nah, he's he's also he's also pretty mature about it, bro. Okay, like, cool. He's also like he's also pretty mature okay, about cool. it. So we can have like he he'll even tell you like yo, he thinks Reese is the most oh. fire rapper out here. Like like it's not like it's not none of that, bro. Okay, cool. Like, it's not none of that, really. Yeah. Like, trust me. Yeah, cause I mean that. the way it was, bro, it got to a point where I was like, them niggas them niggas oh, might all even that. get physical. I don't know. That was, you know, when with the Instagram and the yeah, back and forth was all going that, out. All that is just, I, like, honestly, bro, how I see it, all that, it was just like, you know, just a bunch of social media and like yeah. external factors. Yeah. You feel me? But yeah, man, let's not talk about that. Yeah, yeah. But when shit, okay, just like on the last department point, when shit like that happens, does it sort of like break down the camaraderie within the PTA sort of, you know, uh, you know, family or community or rappers or whatever you want to call it? I don't think so. Okay. I don't I don't really think so, bro, because it's like I'm cool with Kilo, Kilo's cool with Reese, I'm cool with Flame, Flame's cool with Kilo. You feel me? It's mm. like Zuchi's cool with Reese, I'm cool with Zoo. It's like ain't none of that, bro. It's just about yo, who you whoever you cool with, you cool. Like we don't inherit no beefs. Okay. It don't it don't I mean, unless you do something foul to my nigga oh, for yeah, real. Yeah. You oh, feel yeah. me? Like then it's like, okay, fuck you for real. Okay. But that's probably gonna be how I, I'm feeling it's not gonna be mm. because my nigga feels like that. okay cool it's gonna be because of how I really feel it's gonna be coming from me straight up because it's like you inherit a beef and then tomorrow the niggas is cool you stuck in an awkward position you feel me it's like that that uh Meek Mill and Drake with Funk Flex mm. when, when Meek Mill was beefing with Drake he was busy calling Drake a, a, a bitch and like mm. yo Funk Flex was busy saying hey hey Fuck Drake, eh, eh. and then Meek went back to the show. And no, you look stupid. They were cool, and then <laughs> he's like, "Nah, me and Jay cool." He even did the freestyle on the Drake beat, and yeah. then Flex was he had to look stupid as fuck. Yeah. I was like, "Yo, I, I'm gonna call Drake and say sorry." It's like, yeah. bro, what was your point? You yeah. didn't know that, that. You feel me? Like, what was your stance in that? Yeah, it didn't make sense. So yeah. that's just how I see. Like, for me, it's like unless I feel that certain way about you, like. If it's not that from me, then yeah. I don't inherit no beef, bro. Have have have, have dudes ever, ever tried coming to you like that? Like a, from a beef perspective or you just saw you just found a certain vibe with somebody like, bro, this nigga coming up on me some weird vibes though. Nah, bro. Okay. Nah, so it's, bro. It's, I'm 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 like like I don't know if it's the fact that I'm like very direct or if it's like the fact that I'm a I'm I'm usually like a chilled back guy getting stoned, never in the vibe also. I'm always mm. at the crib or in the studio. Mm. You feel me? So I don't run into problems like that. And also whenever I am outside, niggas don't view me like that. Like yeah. people niggas just greet me with respect and I give them the same type of respect they give me. Facts. So it's just like I, I, I haven't had a, a situation like that before. Yeah. You feel me? Yeah. Yeah. I, mean, I, I haven't had that. I'm 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 too I'm too honest and like straightforward and like you know like 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 if something is bothering me i will tell you and if you feel a certain way about that then i guess that's you you feel me yeah this is like that's what i'm saying like I, i've never had a situation like that i respect the maturity i respect that you are your own person i respect that you are your own you put your career first yeah, because sure. all this other bullshit Nothing like in matters, a year bro. like and it's just like it's a trend and then after that it's gone and it's then gone. you use you, you look you look like the stupid dude exactly but so it's, like it's, it's like if, if i inherited that beef and then you know yeah 
tomorrow the opportunity to work with whoever I'm beefing with comes yeah. and it's like a good move for me yeah. and now I can't do that because I inherited some stupid shit yeah. that now is not even there no more you yeah. feel me so yeah. Like, yeah. that makes sense for me bro Diamonds what should we expect from you bro like and, and, and this is just from a holistical point of view why are we doing this rap shit like yeah, we're recording, we get trophies, you know, shout out to your hype, shout out to, you know, um, SA Hip Hop Awards. But what are we doing this shit for? What's the what's the long game plan with this, man? For me, bro, it's just, for me, it kind of felt like a, like a calling, you know, kind of felt, it kind of felt like a calling. Really, kinda, dog? Yeah, it felt like something I had to do. Oh, around, around about what age did you start feeling like that? Um... I think from I think my high school my high school years it was something I wanted to do. Then when I got into my tertiary years, mm. that's when I started feeling it. Like okay, the same like what I'm doing right now ain't for me. You feel me? I come pretending. I, I, I feel more alive doing this when shit. I'm when I'm at studio. Like yeah, every time I'm at I'm at uh, university or whatever the fuck I'm doing, like yeah. doing assignments. Or I mean, obviously it's not fun, but yes. Like, Studio sometimes is not fun too. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, but I, I'd rather be there not having struggle. fun yeah. than not having fun in the fucking classroom or whatever. In a, in a nine to five or all that shit. Like, it's just, it's not me, bro. Like, even in my, in my, my, my dialect, like my conversation, like when I talk to oh, I, yeah. I cuss a lot. Yeah. So it's like, I can't change that. <laughs> I, can't, I, can't, I can't change that don't, gonna, don't blame me it's hip hop bro yeah, I'm gonna now walk in the office now I'm supposed to be you know, I'm supposed to be told what to do oh, yeah. you feel me like that's not I'm, it's not in me bro like I was born to be a boss man yeah you feel me like I was born to yeah. be a boss and for me music music was that thing that I was like I was drawn to that I was more you know I was you feel me bro yeah. like it was inside of me and I had to just let it out okay yeah so it's, yeah. it's, it's, it's more of that for me yeah what's the next major move we're about to do right now um we about to drop the next video shout out you feel what I'm saying who should we expect on it nah just me just you yeah okay. just me just yeah me. more of you drop, about to drop the next video yeah um I got a little. I got a little. Some. Some. Before end of the year. Don't worry. I'm on. I'm on. Yeah. Just keep your eyes. We are gonna get the exclusive. Gotta, you already know we are gonna get the exclusive. I got a little. Some. I got a little. Some coming. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's a big announcement. Yeah. Um, it's, it's, it's a great achievement in my life. I okay. I don't want to disclose it right now. Okay. Is it is, it? is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? Nah, it's an achievement. Oh, okay. Okay. It's an achievement. It's, it's, an achievement. Like, yeah. it's a trophy. Yeah. So oh, yeah. It's a little achievement. I'm oh, yeah. it's, it's it's amazing for me. Oh, yeah. so it's a milestone in my career. Okay. Um. Yeah, man. I'm, I mean, right now I'm really focused on in the trap. Okay, you know what I'm saying. I mean, I was I was cooking up a second project, Dope. but I uh, kind of put that on pause because I I'm up and down and up doing and all down. this crazy shit. Yeah, yeah. So I'm just right now I'm just focusing on in the trap, making sure the people receive it well. Okay, making cool. Making sure you know everything's running smooth with yeah. that and everything's crazy. So that's what I've been focused on a lot okay. right now. But the music is there, my G. Okay. Like trust me, in okay. the trap was just like. It's only seven songs. Mm. I'm, I'm literally. I it was fire, bro. I literally like nigga, lived in for the that. studio. Like we needed hip hop, needed that. Yeah, for sure. Shout yeah, out, my G, shout yeah. Out. But yeah, like that was that was that was a quick little like, bro. But I like that seven. That seven, just you know, a little, yeah. a little something yeah, to hold yeah. you. I mean, when I was, not too much, but it's it's, it's enough. Like, let me tell you, right? When yeah. I was when I was working on in the trap, I wasn't initially working on in the trap. I was, okay. I was I was working on two projects at at one time. Okay. Right? I was working on what was supposed to be my album. Okay. And in the trap. Okay, cool. So my initial plan was to drop the pro the the EP just before the album, right? Okay, cool. But then I decided I'm not ready for album. Okay, cool. You feel me? I'm like, nah, my album has to be a hey, boy. Like my album has to be something. fire, fuego, bro. It has to be something <laughs> else. Like it's gonna be fucking amazing. Yeah. Right? So I'm like. It, it can't come out now. Okay. It can't come out now. It can't yeah. come out next year. Yeah. Who knows? It Who might knows? not even come out the following year. You know, yeah. it might come out five nah, years Nah, but from don't now. starve us like that, bro. I'm not going to starve you. I'm going to give you all the EPs. Okay. You know what I'm saying? The okay. EPs are going to keep coming. Okay. But that, that's what I was trying to explain. Like, In the Trap was just something I, I did. Like, mm. when I when I stopped, when I when I finally told myself that, nah, stop working on the album right now. Like, don't do that. That's when I was like, all right, let me just do this EP thing quickly and just give it to the people. Okay, cool. So that wasn't even like. I mean, I mean, I was having a conversation with Les on our way here. Like, it's like we were saying. I was saying like, um, people like people think. I mean, it, it, people think we we put in a lot of effort, or you know, into yeah. it. But but it's like, it is it is a lot of effort. I'm not gonna lie and say it's not no effort, right? There is some effort, but at the level of skill we're at, 
it seems effortless. Do you feel what I'm saying? Facts. The level of skill we're at, it seems effortless. So for me, that's what it felt like within the trap. And for people to receive it like that, it's like, shit, it's amazing for me. So it's like, okay, now when I really punch in, you feel what I'm saying? Like, I wonder how they're going to take that one. Mm. You feel me? Because that one was just like a little Scooby snack. It's just okay. like, clack, 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 quick fast. Head at. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Man? Yeah. We out. Yeah. But the reception is amazing for it. Okay. Like, you feel me? Like, I'm, 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 I'm out here doing all of this for that. Yeah. So that's fine. Like, I really, yeah. I really, I fuck with that. And shout out to the fans for getting that, man. Shout, shout out, out to, to the, the fans fan. for bumping that. Yeah. Man. Fucking love y'all. I got some coming for y'all too, man. Okay. So here's what, here's what we're going to do. And I'm, 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 I'm going to hijack you since we got the producer in the building. Yeah, for sure. Um, for the fans. Yeah. Let's bring our cameras, you know. Behind the scenes, exclusive Nyan in studio. Yeah. Just so we can bring in that environment to understand, yeah. you know, when something like in the trap is happening. Yeah. You know, how does what what actually happens in studio? Let me bring this let's have the DM crew come in and 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 you know, just document that experience for the fans. I mean, yeah, bro, that's cool. I mean, I I, I recently I was I was I was on a little rant on Twitter, like I think yesterday or the day before. Yeah. Some some fan tweeted me and he's like, yo. Shit, your pen game's fire, bro. You know, like, yeah, you fire with the pen game. I'm like, yo, bro, I don't even write the shit. Shit, you know like, I don't even, I don't even be writing the shit, bro. Like, oh, yeah. that's crazy. So oh, another yeah. fan pulled up and he was like, yo, nigga, you cap it. You feel me? Yeah. He's like, yo, make a song on Instagram Live and show. So I'm like, how? Mazel Tov was made on Instagram Live. What the fuck was you at? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, I was with a fan. Yeah. Named that song Mazel Tov. Mm. I didn't even name that song. You feel me? Like yeah. a fan on Instagram live literally said, yo, you got to call the song Muzzle Top. And I was like, hey, that's actually not that fuck with that name. I'm going to call it that for real. Yeah. You feel me? And yeah. like, that's why I ended up like, the real ones really know. So I would actually love for that to happen. So okay. I could, you know, I mean, I it's don't, done, I, don't I feel like I don't, I don't have nothing to prove. Yeah. But it's just like, just to show the, the fans ones that really, really know, know. That yeah. I, like, yeah, I really do this. Yeah. Like I'm really that nigga. Yeah. You feel what and I'm also, saying? I think they deserve it, man. Like you've had a wonderful, you've had a one wonderful eighteen months, man. Let's just yeah. reward them with some. Let them. Let's let's bring them into our confidence. You know. Yeah, and I always I always do, bro. Like my yeah. fans, like like they know when I'm in studio, like I always go on live. I play them the shit. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah, like even for example with Muzzle Tough, like yeah. I, I had the fans and then involved. Like yo, God, what are we gonna name the song? Like oh, yeah. what do you want me to rap about? Yeah, you feel me? And they gave me like everything, like the the. The concepts and the subject matter is like, yo, rap about rap about this. And I'm like, all right, cool. Okay. Create a ball fast, punch it in. Like, yo, what else do you want me to rap about? Da, 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 da. That's Dope. what I'm saying. Like, I even said on the live, I was gonna name it Muzzle Top featuring the fans. You feel me? But oh, I just, I just, shit. I just never did that. Yeah. But yeah, that was yeah. like that, that was a dope thing. I was doing it for the fans to show them that like, yo, yeah. I'm, this is really for y'all. It ain't just for me. You feel okay. me? Like it's really for y'all. I'm not making this music to fucking hold it and listen to it alone in the studio it's yeah. for y'all so y'all gotta fuck with it so this one song on the project i'm gonna involve y'all with it you feel definitely, me? definitely give y'all that feeling of involvement in there like make you a, make you a, a, a part of it you are part of this thing that i'm doing yeah you feel me? because it's for them anyway you get me yeah so that's what i'm doing for. hey i'm talking to you guys on the comment section subscribe my dns podcast we only give you the exclusive man don't get it twisted you just heard it from the horse's mouth so we going to bring y'all some exclusive content. Don't worry, we got you. For sure. My boy Dime is just, you know, we, we chopped it. It's done. Yeah, like, it's just one that. of those situations. So, sure. subscribe, comment, um, and, 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 and be ready. We're going we gonna to do something special for you. It's going to be a My movie. nigga, uh, thank you for your time. Shout out, man. You're Thanks for blessing. having me, bro. It's such a blessing. We need, we need, we need, we need hip-hop right now. Yeah, for sure. We need real hip-hop. Yeah. I keep telling people I love my piano. Yeah. But... I want to be dancing and rapping. I want niggas yeah. to rap. Yeah, for sure. I don't really like piano, but it's like, I respect it. Yeah. You know, it's 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 really, it's doing well for yeah. the South African music industry. 100%. From a global perspective. Yeah, from a global perspective. I mean, I mean music culture. is always going to be bigger than us. Yes, sir. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, it might not be for me, but I need yes, to understand sir. the power it has. Yes, you know? Like I respect it as a genre and it's like, I respect the people that are doing it. Like, yes, sir. They're doing it real big and yeah. they're doing it really well. Now nah, so they're fucking up the streets for real. I applaud that, you feel me? I really yeah. applaud that, but it's just not for me. How do they be, Majita? Let's feel me, let's do that. You <laughs> shout out Pretty Ugly for that, too. Shout out Pretty Ugly for real. Like, hey, man, Pretty Ugly family. Yo, yeah, Ugly. Let's fucking rap, dog. We also come in your studio, nigga. I'm going to call you up. Don't even worry about it. <laughs> anyway, shout out, shout out to you. Subscribe, comment. You know what it is. It's your boy, yeah. Cybersonic DM. 
my DMs podcast rather. Shit, so hot, my nigga. Like, I'm fumbling up my words. Yeah, anyway, it's, it's the internet. It's real life. Y'all know what it is. Shout out to so, my boy Diamonds for coming through. Go Shout get, out to the Go t- get that In The Trap EP. Yes, sir. Check out that Itchy Palmer's video. Yes, sir. Yeah, this video. Got something coming for y'all soon, too. Yeah. Run that up. Look, we're going to give y'all some exclusive content. The summer's coming up. We got all... We bring you up and close with your favorite star. You know what I'm saying? We're not fucking 